Hey guys, it's Amos awesome, by the way, and today we're looking at the pub quickly achievement on the Untitled Goose Game. I was actually quite proud of this run. I only attempted this maybe twice before I managed to get this run, and it ended up really well. I found a really good way to achieve a good time on this run is to work on how to drop a bucket on the burly man's head first. You can gain the burly man's attention pretty quickly by jumping out of the box early. Then you run away from him and run under the deck, so he's looking for you. If you noticed, I ran around the left side of the plant to help bring that burly man closer to the gate so that I can then attract his attention with the tomatoes. While I was running back to get the bucket for the burly man, I went to go check on what the old man was doing. I saw that he was just about to throw a dart, so I thought I'll break the dart board. Still gave me plenty of time to then drop the bucket on the burly man's head. If you want to paint his bum red, make sure there's a few more tomatoes on the ground for him to fall onto. And then also while the burly man is distracted, it's a perfect time to grab that pint glass and put it in the canal. He should be distracted long enough trying to get the bucket off his head for you to drop the pint glass into the canal and then run back without having to jump inside a box and sneak your way back in. Next I started slowly gathering items for the picnic table. At this point I'd forgotten that the candlestick is too big to fit under the table. So don't forget that. Very important. Make sure that you don't have the bartender woman's attention so you can go and hide it under the deck. Because another of the to-do list has to do with the old man during one of his cycles, I thought I'd go check to see what he was up to and I saw he was about to sit down with his harmonica. I wasn't quite close enough to get his attention so I honked. This distracts him long enough so that I can get in a good position in order to run through and grab the chair and pull it away from him. The sooner you go to grab his stool, the better. If you do it too late, he will realise that the stool is gone, which is quite weird in that regard. So as soon as he does the animation to go to sit down on the stool is when you have to pull it away. While you're down here, you might as well get the flower, so do a good job and perform well for these ladies, they deserve it. While I was waiting for the toy boat to be ready, I was collecting all the other items and stashing them under the picnic table to make it a little bit easier to then transfer them to under the deck. I was trying to distract her so she wouldn't go to turn off the water. The good thing is that with the layout of all the picnic tables, it's very easy to distract her long enough to get what you need. I found on one of my random practice runs was that if you drop the toy boat too soon after grabbing it, it doesn't actually register that you have finished that to-do task, so make sure you hold it long enough for it to register. At this point I've collected all the items for the setting up the table, so I'm just taking them down to the deck. That delivery lady almost ruined that for me by making me drop that pepper shaker. So for the rest of the time I'm pretty much just transferring everything from under the deck onto the table there. 
The good thing is that the delivery lady does not care what you do whatsoever. After putting the plate down, you should have the achievement. Congratulations, guys, and that should be the very last one.